So we're here with Dr. Temper, who from uh, near Southampton, who dro drove out to us because we have a few fish uh, with Popeye. Uh, with, we're trying to identify whether it is a bacterial infection, uh, gas uh, in the tank, or what exactly. So he's going to withdraw some fluid from the eye. We're going to culture it and give some of the fish some betrol shots. Go ahead, Doc. Let's let's play some play some eye games, which I'm not a big fan of. This is a, this is a, a, a small conspic. And we're just you, you can see we're how dealing with only one eye. One eye. Yep. We're checking eyes here. We've had some cases of Popeye, and we need to know whether it's gaseous coming from micro bubbles, engines. Uh, you know, we have a hydro wizard that cavitates. Or is this a bacterial infection? Or is it an infection from a fluke on an eye? So we're all trying to figure this out. In the meantime, he's taking samples of the eye, he's degassing the eye, and he's giving them shots of Batril. because of the fact that we're concerned about what might be going on inside the eye, we're gonna be sampling. Oh, I pulled it, I see where it's not in the lens. You pulled it behind it. Just nice. Pull it out? No. No? It's flatter. Yeah, that was gas in there. That was gas. Does that give you any clue? It does. We're going to plan B. And the dosage for this bait trail is exactly how much per weight of the fish, roughly? 10 to 15 milligrams per kilo. Per kilo. Yeah. So we're looking at here a fish that weighs 70 grams and a concentration of 22 milligrams per ml. So dividing that all up, we're, we're going to be at about 0.05 ml okay. or five units if you're using an insulin right. syringe. That's the nice thing about the U100 insulin syringe. Right. It's divided up into hundredths of an ml. Jack, I have this is 22 milligrams per ml, but I have a 100 milligrams per ml. So for the even big koi, it's only a couple of tenths of, a, of an ml. Yeah. Whereas uh, if I'm dealing with goldfish or bettas, they're small enough that the bass seem to work right. if I can't inject them. I can inject them too, but we have to dilute it. But uh, there the bass seem to work. So this is kind of an unusual range here. Why were you able to just, in a millisecond, just get right to the... Just do exactly what needed to be done versus, I mean, obviously. Didn't you ever hear, don't try this at home? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 